Okay, this is just going to be hopefully a short video because I want to eat my lunch. Um, things just aren't what they always appear or you kind of know what you're going to get. Uh, anyway, like this veggie pasta. Mm. It's not too bad, but see, check out, okay, the, the, the pasta. Kind of yellowy, light colored. Okay, it's veggie pasta. Now, I don't think that looks light colored. Still ain't bad. But it doesn't match the bag. Anyway, I've been putting off because my eyesight, I need bifocals, is that uh, I ordered a magnifier. And I should have just got a regular magnifier for looking at little dates and things, like a 20 power or something. But no, I decided I'm going to get a light. Then I'm cheap. I want it to be lighted. So I, I know I'm going to get junk. But it was 4.55 with free shipping. That's another complaint I have is that why yeah, I don't have a problem with drop shipping, I don't have a problem with China, I don't have a problem with any of that. I like cheap stuff too, but it doesn't make sense to me why me being an eBayer in this country can't send anything other than new stuff with eBay, which I don't use yet, is the cheapest first class with the tracking is going to cost me basically about four bucks now. And more if it goes further. But uh this somehow could be sold to me for four dollars and fifty-five cents, free shipping, and have a battery in it and a magnifier, which I don't really care for. It's not very good. You have to slide it out. You can turn the switch on, but I don't know yet. I haven't really got to use. I tried it in the van. I didn't think it was much, but for what it costs, fine. Well, I came home from. Uh, let's see if it works. Uh, uh, I don't know. Uh, anyway, I came home from town Saturday, and there was a note saying I had to pick up a thing. I might try to insert it here, but I probably don't know how. Uh, I sent the person thing saying I owed three dollars and ninety-four cents. Well, see, well, when I got picked up today. The company already said they have an issue with their thickness of their packages is why the post office sometimes charged me. They said they'd credit me right away. There's no excuse for why I had to pay or I have to pay anything. But I have not seen the refund yet, so I'll have to contact them. Well, anyway, they tried to send this thing inside a packet inside a first-class letter postage, 51 cents, because they probably printed it themselves. And it got rejected. The baby. Bloop. I just said their name. I maybe I'll bloop it out, but uh, yeah. Uh, but that's why I had to pay. So now I have to get online since I spent the almost four dollars to pick the dumb thing up. Uh, I'm going to make sure they do something, or I'm also going to ask for a refund through eBay. Anyway, on that note, that's my complaint, my rant, whatever it may be, just to be. Uh, wondering, I don't know, I don't even know what the video is for, I guess, because I know what I was getting. I didn't expect to get a bill. Anyway, my other thing was dollar at Walmart. Uh, these are normally good. Okay, I know they're garbage. I shouldn't eat the crap. But, I, uh, and the date, uh, let's see, what it was May 27th. I'm pretty sure it meant 2020, not 2021, but... I spit the half of the one out and I threw the other, the third one out the freaking window. And I have a second pack. I don't know what it is when you buy a second one thinking they're going to be good and then they aren't. And I'm just glad my stomach has settled because I was afraid I'd be sick like that time I ate expired Twinkies from Country Fair after drinking all night. <laughs> the good old days. Anyway, until next time, maybe there'll be an auction haul video tonight. Uh, I don't know yet. There's a few things up there like some aquarium stuff I'm looking at getting if it's possible, but probably everybody will want it. Until later, I guess. I'm not sure if the blue light's better on this or the white light. I'm not sure what the blue is for. I guess to help maybe details. Hmm. All right.